Over here I've just whipped out a bit of MDF and I made a big compass and drew a big radius on it. I'm going to convert a chair I have at home into a rocking chair. So this is a template that I'm going to screw on the legs and see how it rocks. So this is the chair. These are the rockers, template rockers. Go under there. And I guess I'm just going to trial and error. So I started by screwing one on where I thought it looked like a rocking chair sort of thing. Drew some lines on the back, then transferred them over to the other one so it was in the same spot. Screwed it on. I think it looks pretty legit. It's pretty balanced. Now there's one, only one screw in each leg, either side. But I need to see who to rock with a person on it, so... Easy. <laughs> Three. You got it really good. Doesn't get too far back. You can really give it a good lean. I think you're right on the first try. <sighs> so I'm back at the shop. Uh, my idea is I'm going to make the rockers out of laminated maple. The legs on the chair look like maple, and I use maple for the hardwood longboard. So I went and picked up a big chunk. Time to rip. Right, so I just ripped up 18 strips. They're roughly around uh, an eighth thick. I just guessed it. No tape measuring. Um, and the reason why I come up with 18 is because nine of them make roughly an inch. I was thinking an inch is a nice round number. Now I need to make a jig. So, yeah. This is gonna be the jig for the rockers. Two bits of three quarter MDF to make up one and a half. Um, I just made a quick compass, very rough, didn't even screw it down. I'm going to cut this thickness out, that's the thickness of the veneers plus a bit of glue. I changed my mind, um, I don't need to cut that, that section out of the middle, I can just do one cut. I know I confused myself, I thought I needed to allow for the meat, but the curve's that, that small, it doesn't really matter. These are two laminated maple rockers for the rocking chair, straight out of the clamp jig. Um, they came out super strong. Now I just need to plane them, shape them, sand them.